Hi, this is the video for rapid COVID testing. So you first want to make sure that you have all your testing equipment pieces, your cassette, alcohol prep, lancet, your buffer, and your pipette. You're first going to take your finger and we're going to clean the area. Make sure the finger is nice and warm. It'll be harder to get blood from. We're going to let that dry. You do not want wet alcohol. Now, the tricky thing with the lancet is this little top. You are going to take this off like this and throw it away. There is a spring in here. When you push down on the skin, the spring will push the needle into the skin and puncture it. The other thing, you want to be able to have your buffer ready. So we're going to keep that open and set it aside. So now the finger is dry. We're going to go to the tip. I'm milking it a little bit so we get a lot of blood at the top. You want to get to the side of the finger and push down. Set your lancet down and now you're going to milk the finger so you get a nice drop of blood. The pipette is a little tricky. You're going to squeeze at the top and pull blood into the pipette. Like I said, it is tricky to do. If you cannot do it with some pipettes, it's hard to do. There we go, we got some, we're gonna get some more. You can carefully drip the blood into the sample hole. We're gonna do two drops. One, oops, got sucked back up in there. One drop, it's not working. So we're gonna flip the finger over and we're gonna try to drip it into the sample spot. You want just a good amount of blood. It only takes two drops to get a sample amount. There we go. You can use your old alcohol swab as a bandage if you'd like. You can hold that on there. Now, you have the sample in the circle. You're now gonna add two drops of the buffer. So one, there's one, and two. Now you wait 10 minutes for it to cook. With your instructions, you'll see the lines up here. You're, we're starting to see some movement there as we do it, but we will wait 10 minutes for our final results. I hope this was helpful.